Welcome to today's Tesla Semi Factory construction video. This video was taken Thursday, October 17th, about 7.30 in the morning on a cool, crisp morning. Yesterday's planned drone flight was canceled due to weather. So you can see for the first time in a long time um, what the site looks like after a, a moderate rain. In any event, there's a lot of big things that happened today. I can count at least four major um, watershed events, so to speak. One of them we just saw is they've begun to add panels, wall panels, to the western perimeter, working down towards from the north to the south. It's pretty exciting. Another thing, another new thing is this um, staircase leading to the roof. Uh, we've seen these at all the other gigafactories, and that's the first one here. You notice how these wall panels are staggered up, and then they trim them to the uh, slope of the roof. And, uh, yeah, this is exciting. Those are those long sections are um, the wall panels, those long white things. And the short ones, I don't know exactly what they're for. Maybe they're for um, where the doors are, but... If I'm not mistaken, these doors were cut out after the wall panels were added. That's going to be an entrance and exit from the uh, to to and from the uh, the new the factory when it's completed. You can see that in the rendering also, and I'll include that rendering at the end of every video, like I do, so you can see compare the progress to the uh, to the rendering, which seems to be very accurate. Next piece to the east on the north, section four is right there where they moved the wall panel, the panel table, I should say. Um, interesting that they, my first thought when they moved the panel table there is that they would build sections five and six around it and then move it to, to, to fill in section four. But on second thought, I think that there's a very good chance that they will build section four and thereby enclose the wall, the panel table, and they'll be able to build roof sections out of the elements. And the uh, the high desert Nevada weather is coming. And um, if you don't know, this section of northern Nevada is at an elevation of 4,000 feet. So it's desert, but it's extremely cold, generally dry desert, but when it does rain, it can be um, what they call a gully washer. So it'd be very interesting to see how they, if they were able to arrange the wall panel, 
the panel table in such a way as to avoid footings or maybe they'll put those footings in later but um, it'll be fascinating to see if they're able to uh, enclose the um, that section four and if you can see right there that's actually the end of section three one of the other big things and you can see they've not completed the setup of that panel table yet but um, I imagine that'll be done in a few days here's one of the other big events is they're they're paving the uh, path the road coming down from Giga Nevada proper and this little uh, staging area where the contractors buildings are they've uh, begun to pave down to the um, down to the Tesla semi-factory construction site, and you'll get a little better look at it later. This is a beautiful view of Giga Nevada and the surrounding mountains. I'm looking forward to the day when the sun rises over those mountains to the east, and um, 135 Tesla semis are roll out of that factory every day. This is the intersection of section three and section five along the northern perimeter. And thanks for joining. Appreciate it and uh, hope you uh, stay tuned for further updates.